I'm Kate Rooney for uscfootball.com here at spring practice with offensive coordinator and running backs coach Kennedy Palamalu. Coach, can you talk a little bit about what in, what went into the decision to move Trey Madden to tailback? Well, it all started with the head coach, uh, Coach Kiffin. Um, you know, I've been teasing him for a while. I want that big size uh, guy that can hopefully finish a game off at uh, 220 plus pounds at 226. And then in the off season, uh, just saw his athleticism in the individual drills that we did with our strength coach. And then he ran a really nice 40 time in front of the team. And he was just doing things right. And then watching him and watching him, I would always, you know, hey, Trey, how are you doing? You know, when you're ready, come over and, and you can, we can share time. And then Coach Kiffin thought about it and thought about it. And then over the break, he, he uh, came with Trey on a Tuesday and said, hey, Coach P, this is your guy. You know, we're going to have a tryout uh, and see if he likes uh, being a running back. And then he also saw the depth chart, um, you know, with Curtis McNeil and then with uh, DJ Morgan and then Buck Allen at, uh, at the scholarship uh, running back position and then Soma at fullback. We just didn't have the depth. And uh, what an opportunity. And uh, he, he's, it's, it's been fun. Coach Kiffin has said that his biggest issues are ball security and learning the playbook. So how are you working on those things with him? Every every minute that we have a chance, uh, we're, we're going to drill the ball. We're going to drill, you know, he's not used to being hit. Um, he's uh, up there pulling tape, uh, asking questions, uh, you know, using uh, what we call our huddle program uh, to catch up everything. And remember, he's he's been on the other side of the ball. I like his aggression. I like the way he moves. I like his feet and balance. Now we just have to get the makeup of the mind game. And uh, I think he'll be fine. Where's he going to fit in with guys like Curtis McNeil and DJ Morgan? Well, it's like, like anything else, and anybody that plays the position, they all want to play. Um, obviously, Curtis has been productive, and DJ has played. He hasn't, but um, we're going to give him every opportunity to play, and I need him to play, and uh, that we're preparing him as though if something happens, I hope nothing happens to Curtis, uh, you know, that he's ready to play and, and, and protect our quarterback and, uh, and make this offense and help this offense move the ball and score touchdowns. It looks like Curtis and DJ are both having really solid springs. What are you working on with the two of them? Uh, being consistent, uh, putting them in a stressful situation as much as possible. Uh, uh, think beyond, see the big pictures and, and know the little details of the big picture and uh, help them see the field more, see it faster and, and see all the little uh, indicators, things that happen and uh, they both have done a nice job and, and it's, it's fun, it's fun. The mental part of the game, it's, uh, it's fun when they see things. You mentioned it before, and I think most people would agree that the running back position is of, of a big concern to a lot of people going into the fall. What are some of the other um, issues on the offense that you're working on? Well, we're also, again, making sure that we can protect that quarterback. Uh, so uh, obviously we're, we're trying to solidify the offensive line. And then right now the the depth at wide receiver, obviously with uh, George coming back today, that's helped with Marquise Lee and then, then with Robert Woods. But even with those key guys, we need guys that can step up and back up. And that's nice for Flournay to, to, find, you know, to show that in the last two practice. Uh, our tight ends need to get healthy as well. Uh, but uh, overall, you know, that's what spring football is for, trying to help and trying to find where we need to improve. And uh, just, I, I, we just, you know, Coach Kiffin's just done a nice job of understanding that our guys just need to work hard and, uh, and and basically the sign that you walk right through here said it's about the prep, not the hype. And I think these young men have done that. At spring practice on Howard Jones Field, I'm Kate Rooney. You can log on to uscfootball.com for more.